Hi parents, my name is Mrs. Grant and I am your child's um, student library aid teacher. Um, just wanna kinda talk to you about what um, library aid is and what's gonna be going on in the class for this year. So basically, what is a student library aid? I know many of you thought, okay, my child is just gonna have an extra study hall. No, um, a student library aid is a position where eighth grade students work in the Pat's library. So they're actually having like that first introductory job. Um, it is considered a no grade class, which means they will get a 100, but I do not tell them that. I um, the, My goal is for them to work as hard as if they are earning an actual grade. Um, some duties that they will be doing while they're in the library is, um, they will be checking book returns and they will be um, checking in those particular books and putting those books in quarantine for four days. So they've learned all about the safety guidelines and procedures. Um, they'll be checking in books, shelving books. They have their own shelf that they have to maintain. And I tell them that that shelf is a reflection of themselves, of the library, of myself, so do me proud. Um, they will be assisting staff and students. They will be keeping the library clean and organized I have them delivering items and then they're also assisting students especially those sixth graders with our new self checkout station so um, they are doing a lot in the library expectations that I have for them um, are just basic expectations of any job of any position to be professional to be neat be alert, be available, and be helpful. And what I've learned with eighth graders, this is like their first time having these particular types of expectations. So this year, we're really gonna work on these expectations. What does it necessarily mean to be professional? How can you be neat? It's not the neat like you are with your, your room at home. How do you be alert? I want them to be able to look around the room see what's going on, evaluate and figure out what do I need to do? How do I need to be available and to be helpful? So through these expectations and them through doing their duties, I'm hoping that they're developing skills. I'm hoping, I'm hoping that they're developing customer service skills. Um, I feel like that is so needed now, um, especially when these students are going to be interviewing for their first job, or maybe um, at Reedy, they're going to be interviewing to be a library aide or an office aide or to be an athletic trainer. I want them to have those customer service skills. I want them to have communication skills. I want them to be able to know how to effectively communicate with people to not be afraid to communicate with people, to advocate for themselves. I want them to be a self-starter. I don't want them always to be told what to do, when to do it, how to do it. I want them to be able to learn how to take initiative, learn how to take risks, and just to do their job without me standing over them. And then those organization skills are so important, not just um, in the library, but in life. So that is what we're gonna be working on this year year, um, I just want you guys to understand how appreciative I am that you all allowed your um, children to be a student library aide. Um, they are, um, and it's really without these student aides, the library wouldn't function. I could not do the, my job effectively if I didn't have these students. So I appreciate you all allowing me to have your students, I mean, your children. Um, your children are amazing. I'm learning so much about them. You all have done such an amazing job raising your children. And just know that they're my children now too. I'm gonna take care of them. I'm gonna ensure that we are following the safety guidelines and protocols to keep your children safe because I know they're your most precious commodity. If you ever have any questions or need anything from me, my information is on the screen. And um, again, thank you so much for sharing your kits with me. Have a great day.